Greater Good Radio. Connect, learn, heal, and grow. I was just actually meditating on that this morning where I was thinking about unmet need, right? And the unmet need that drives whatever strategy at that point happens in order to fulfill that. However, we'll do it, right? So let's say the unmet need is I have a need to be highly valued or to be valued. So then my strategy then becomes either you know, getting good grades or being good looking or funny or helpful or successful Mm -hmm. or so on, right? But then I was thinking about, I said, you know, what lies under the unmet need? And then what I was seeing was it was a typically a belief that no longer serves us. Like I am defective. Something is wrong with me. I am bad, which is shame, right? So then my need becomes, I have a strong need to feel valued, And then my strategies can be whatever. And a lot of that is unconscious, right? We just do it and it's like, I don't know why I'm doing it. I just kind of do it. Is is that kind of how you're seeing it too? Or That makes complete sense for me. And there was something that I either read or I was watching a while ago about how when we have those thoughts, like we're defective, we're not good enough, we're not smart enough, we have to kind of look back and think if we were the ones that originally told that to us. Many times it's not. It was somebody else, it was a parent, it was a guardian, and we just absorbed it because the parents kind of formed the structure of the blueprint for how we're going to grow up, right, in those right. years. And so a lot of times it was never ours to own. It, it never came from us. And I think our true selves and our souls wouldn't do that to us anyways. If you resonate with Greater Good Radio, please join our community at www.greatergoodradio.com where you can get access to exclusive content and offerings. Hope to see you soon.